All right, another question we had was about the complement algorithm for subtraction. So let's look at, uh, at how and why that works. Uh, let's start off with just a, an example. So let's say 4,762 minus 3,927. Okay, so the way this the way this algorithm works is that um, let's see, we take the complement of the bottom number here with respect to the same number of nines. So let's say there are four digits, so we'd look be taking the complement of 3,927 with respect to 9,927. Uh, so we do that individually. Um, so I'm sorry, 9,999. So the complement of 7 with respect to 9 is 2. The complement of 2 with respect to 9 is, um, is 7. The complement of 9 with respect to 9 is 0. The complement of, of 3 with respect to 9 is 6. And now what we do is add this, uh, the, the original top number with this complement number. Alright, so 2 and 2 is 4. 6 and 7 is 13, so 3, carry a 1, however you wanted to do that. So 1 and 7 is 8, and 4 and 6 is 10. Alright, so our, we're almost there, but then the, the next part is we take this leading 1, and there always is a leading 1. Uh, we, 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 you could check that if you want to, but there's always a leading 1. Um, and you, uh, you take that 1 and add it to the 1's digit. So the 1 plus the 4 gives you a 5, and your answer is 835. And you can check that with, with any other algorithm, with a calculator or however you want to do that. It's, uh, it's correct. So let's look at, uh, very briefly, let's look at why that works. And I say very briefly because this is not something that I'm all that interested in. But uh, if we think about what's happening here, when we take uh, just just very just an overall heuristic view of, of what's going on we take away one uh, sorry in this case when we take that one and add it to the four what we're actually doing is subtracting ten thousand and adding one well negative or take away ten thousand add one is the same as take away nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine and that should look fairly familiar because that's where we got that complement number it was the complement of 3,927 with respect to 9,999. So this is all very, very conveniently connected. Um, but the point behind the complement algorithm is the, the reason why this is somewhat attractive and, and you know, throughout history, or I, I don't know who, who came up with the algorithm or, or how it was uh, popularized. Um, uh, but the, the the beauty of this algorithm is that there's no real difficult subtraction. Um, you're subtracting from 9 along the way, so 9 minus 7, 9 minus 2, 9 minus 9, and 9 minus 3 in order to get this complement of 6,072. Um, and then after that, it's just adding. And when we subtract off 10,000, it's really the same as just moving that 1. And, and adding a 1 is certainly very easy. So this is an easy algorithm. If you don't like subtraction, you'd like the complement algorithm. Um, so again, I mean, there, there, you could go into more detail and more generalized reasons why this works, um, but just kind of just an overall understanding of why it works. So I hope that helped.